Zhao Lucy's new drama, which CCTV was very optimistic about, was asked to stop broadcasting and be removed from the shelves. Why was the audience so angry? CCTV, a well-known and authoritative media, is always known for its exquisite production and subject selection. It has outstanding performance in both audience ratings and word-of-mouth evaluation. However, even CCTV will inevitably stumble into potholes at some point. Before the TV series Secretly Can't Hide was launched, CCTV's official media encouraged the show, but on the day it was launched, it aroused dissatisfaction among viewers and quickly triggered a series of controversies. Obviously, the secret failed to meet the audience's expectations in terms of plot and character creation, and the audience expected it to be better. The plot is simple and childish, and the plot is awkward. Secretly Can't Hide is lackluster. Maybe a few years ago, the audience was willing to tolerate a sweet drama with no depth like Can't Hide Secretly, but now, the audience's aesthetics and taste have improved significantly, and most mature audiences cannot accept Can't Hide Secretly this kind of work is childish and shallow in content. Judging from the plot direction, the entire series is more like the beautiful fantasy of middle and high school students, simple and straightforward, full of childish and underage elements. However, objectively speaking, the film and television version of Can't Hide has done its best, because the content of the original novel itself is quite shallow, and the text description is lackluster and difficult to attract people. However, the TV version succeeded in making the original's creepy plot and greasy dialogue more acceptable. In the early stages of the play, Sang Zia Chai's feelings for Duan Jiaxu were always shown as family affection. It was not until high school that she gradually realized that she had special feelings for Duan Jiaxu. However, the audience clearly saw the emotional line between the male and female protagonists from the perspective of bystanders. Therefore, pairing a teenage actor with Chen Zhaiyun really made the audience feel uncomfortable. In addition, Duan Jiaxu in the play is like a peacock with its wings spread wide. Whether it was when Sang Zia Chai was a child or in high school, he showed puzzling eyes and words that made people feel uneasy. Some viewers even described seeing these the scene was like biting one's tongue and committing suicide. In addition, there is an embarrassing plot in the play involving Mabokian's voice. During the casting process for Secretly Can't Hide, the news that Mabokian played the role of Sang Yan triggered a strong backlash from fans of the original work, which almost caused them to boycott the entire show. However, after watching the actual broadcast of the episode, the audience discovered that although Mabokian may not be outstanding in appearance, he is the only actor who acts seriously. At least in his performance, the audience can see a real brother, an image full of poisonous tongue, and a very down-to-earth brother image. Her performance feels more like that of a primary school student, her language and behavior seem slow and clumsy. The audience was confused because it was hard to imagine a high school student behaving in such a childish manner. When Zhao Lucy created the character, she seemed to overemphasize the cuteness and cuteness of the character, making her look like a heroine from some kind of milk burp literature. On the other hand, Chen Zhaiyun's performance, although his appearance and hide are online, to deliberately shape the role of Dun Jai Exu. His acting skills reveal a handsome and self-aware greasy feeling from head to toe, and every scene opposite Sang Zia Chai is full of excessive narcissism. No matter how crisp a white shirt he wears, every time the words little sister, brother, child and other words appear, the audience can't help but frown. Overall, there are only three main characters in The Secret. Although Ma Bukian showed natural acting skills, his appearance was not outstanding enough. In addition to the main roles, Zhen Li, who plays Sang Zia Chai's mother, and Ma Bukian's mother are not outstanding enough, and their character creation is slightly bland. Therefore, this drama not only has problems with the content of the original work, but also has obvious shortcomings in casting and character creation. However, in the film and television industry, the rules of reality and helplessness are also clearly revealed. Before a work is adapted into a film or television production, the role of screenwriters and producers is crucial. They must be able to inject new light into outdated work so that they can adapt to current trends and achieve rebirth. However, as the case of Secretly Can't Hide shows, what matters is not faithfulness to the original work, but creativity. Nowadays, it is not surprising that doubts and criticisms have been heard after the show was aired. Finally, please share your thoughts on Can't Hide Secretly. You are welcome to share your views in the comment area. Can't Hide Secretly, a sweet youth love story. Secretly Can't Hide is a youth campus idol drama that fills people's hearts with sweetness. 
This drama is directed by Lee Kingrong, starring Zhao Lucy and Shen Zhewen, starring Ma Bokian, Zheng Li and Qiu Zinzi as guest stars, and Guan Zijing, Wang Yang, and Zhang Heolin as special guests. It will be broadcast on Yoku on June 20th, 2023. The play is adapted from Zuji's novel of the same name, telling the sweet and youthful love story between Du and Jai Aksu and Sang Zhi Sang Zhi played by Zhao Lucy, is a girl who dreams of becoming an adult, while Du and Jai Aksu, played by Chen Zhewen, is a mature, steady and somewhat sinister young man. The two complement each other in their character settings in the play, one is energetic and the other is calm and rational. This kind of character combination is very common in youth romance dramas, but this drama interprets this setting very well. In the play, Sang Zhi feelings for Du and Jai Aksu are hidden deep in her heart. She always tried her best to spend more time with Du and Jai Aksu, and even used various reasons to inquire about his situation. This way of expressing a girl's worries is vividly demonstrated through Zhao Lucy's acting skills. The audience can clearly feel Sang Zhi's inner fluctuations and emotional changes. Du and Jai Aksu's feelings for Sang Zhi are more complicated. He had no special feelings for Sang Zhi at first, but as the plot developed, he was gradually attracted by Sang Zhi's innocence and enthusiasm. Chen Zhewen's acting skills are also very good, and he interprets Du and Jai Aksu's emotional changes very realistically and believably. Overall, Can Hide Secretly is an excellent youth campus idol drama. It shows the youthful and sweet love story between Du and Jai Aksu and Sang Zhi in a real and vivid way, and also presents the distinctive personalities and stories of each character. The success of this drama is not only due to the outstanding performances of young actors such as Zhao Lucy and Shen Zhewen, but also to the careful creation of director Lee Kingrong and the entire production team. It can not only satisfy the audience's fantasy of love, but also make people deeply moved. The work Can't Hide Secretly is undoubtedly an excellent drama worth recommending to everyone. 02. Southern Wind Knows My Will has exceeded 10,000 hits, Cheng Yi's acting skills have been recognized again, and the second co-star Zhang Yuxi is so delicious. As for the most surprising drama in the post-summer season, I think it must be Cheng Yi's partner Zhang Yuxi's Southern Wind Knows My Will. In just one week since its launch, the popularity of Southern Wind Knows What I Want has exceeded 10,000 on a certain cool website. It has always been among the top 5 in the entire network. If it exceeds 10,000 in terms of timing, Southwind Knows What I Want is even faster than Under the Stranger. Such achievements are undoubtedly very dazzling for an urban love drama that has been backlogged for a long time. As for how Southwind Knows My Will successfully broke through in many major dramas such as Cloud Feather and Sunlight With Me, in addition to the quality of the drama itself, perhaps it is the acting skills of all the members, especially the male ones. Zhu Chengai's outstanding performance has won praise from the entire network, and his second match with Zhang Yuxi also fully demonstrates the sense of CP and has become the biggest selling point of the series. As the male protagonist of Southwind Knows My Will, Cheng Yi already has very good appearance conditions. Although most of his previous appearances were costume dramas, his precise grasp of characters and presentation of details are extremely outstanding. With a high standard, Cheng Yi's interpretation of a drug researcher who has a huge psychological reversal this time can be said to be very good. The high spirits in the early stage, the guilt in the later stage, and the many self-abasements after being injured and disabled, as well as the emotional scenes where he and the heroine go back and forth and heal each other, can be said to be vividly displayed under Cheng Yi's expression, and the overall the presentation was very successful, and Cheng Yi's wonderful performance was unanimously recognized by the audience. Moreover, Zhang Yuxi, who plays the heroine, is working together again after Liu Li. The two are highly matched in terms of appearance, acting skills, or their respective popularity. The man is handsome and the woman is beautiful. Regarding the relevant settings of the characters, the scenes of the two of them in the same frame are not only beautiful and full of CP, but also have a very high degree of adaptability, which makes people unable to stop. Of course, in addition to Cheng Yi and Zhang Yuxi's strong sense of CP and excellent matching, which has brought the absolute popularity of Self Wind Knows My Will, the overall production of the work, as well as the acting skills of all supporting actors are online performance is undoubtedly another very important factor. The TV series Southern Wind Knows My Will is created with the efforts of director Liang. The plot has a tight rhythm and moves quickly. From the misunderstanding between the male and female protagonists at the beginning, to experiencing life and death together, to the separation when they want to express each other's feelings, and what follows. Reunion is a very natural transition, allowing the audience to be deeply involved in the plot and story from the perspective of the protagonists. 
Furthermore, the performances of supporting actors such as Fu Zibo, Li Zins, Liang Jingxin, and Yan Xiao are obviously far beyond expectations. Fu Zibo, who is originally thought to be the boss, has a sense of joy and has become the lubricant in many plot lines. Not only is Li Zins outstandingly handsome, but he also handles the character very well. Liang Jingxin also has a new level of beauty, and her compatibility with the character is also very high. Therefore, with the production of the series being excellent and the performance of the supporting roles not holding back, Chang Yu's acting skills have once again received praise, as well as the delicious emotional scenes with Zhang Yuxi, which will undoubtedly increase the popularity in various projects of South Wind Knows My Will the results continue to improve, and finally successfully achieved a score of over 10,000 in a week, which was very surprising. According to the current popularity of the series, I believe that if the subsequent plot is more exciting and the overall attraction is more interesting, Southwind Knows My Will will continue to create higher and better results. Let's wait and see.